105 FM KSJS Ilphonic Show Lucidal DJ Ray's Dirt Nasty right here. What's going oh, on? Yeah. Man? What's up, man? Real quick shout out to Cal Rissy and my boys from the Dub Esquire. Salacious. Uh, all the Oakland homies, all the Alameda Rip homies, us. all the Frisco homies. Yeah. And, 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 uh, we're in the Zay. We're in the Zay. We're in the zone. Sand Hall to 408. That's so right. we just played uh, your drum right there, Andre Legacy. Yeah, thank uh -huh. you. You got, you'll be uh, rocking that tonight over at the show? Oh, for sure, for that sure. And, and Bender. I love Bender. We'd always do that and Bender. You know, you know, I didn't have it clean, but it's okay, you know. I love, I love that joint. Thank you, homeboy. boy. Thank you. For sure, man. Those are the staple cuts. We do those all the time, for sure. Right on. So, uh, new stuff. Yeah. Let's get into that. Well, yeah. we've been working. We're about to release. Each of us are going to do an EP, like, in the next couple months. I just did a couple songs with Too Short. Just did a song with Warren G. Did a song with... I'm dropping names. I don't care. He's dropping. Uh, <laughs> who else did I do a song? But the Two Short ones are Del. crazy, did man. did a oh, song with Del. Me and Dub Esquire and Del the Funky. Some guy, Hyrule. Yeah, Hyrule. yeah man. There. It's crazy. I got a bunch of good guest tracks on my new album, so... The next one's, uh, after 1980, that's kind of like, I saw the success of that song and how mm. much everyone loved it. My new album's going to be a lot more that up-tempo party, like LMFAO tempo, you know, yeah, yeah, party yeah. stuff. That's, right that's what's cracking right now. It is. People want to yeah. dance, man. You know, yeah. People want to party. Even in the Bay, it's getting yeah. the hypey stuff. Everything kind of sped up a lot. Yeah. So I'm just kind of rolling with the times and, and uh, just doing that party music, you know what I mean? Are you going to be handling the production on that album? Uh, I Actually, I produced a lot of my first stuff, but this newer, I, I got all these great producers now that have been reaching out, so I got out, like, I just worked with the Alchemist, uh, you know, been working with Mark Ronson, like all these really yeah. top-notch producers, okay. wow. so now my beats are kind of falling to the wayside. But uh, Beardo produces beats, I'll probably get a couple from Very him. Nice. And, yeah. and uh, yeah, so I don't think, uh, maybe I'll, I might have a couple of my beats, but I just got so many good ones from everyone else, it's like, I don't okay. know. You know? Okay, so yeah. now you're saying they're alchemists. Yeah, alchemists. Okay, now I see evidence in your old video. Yeah, that's my homie. Okay. He's down with KSJS as well. Yeah. So, how does that connection work? Tell me a little bit about being in the L.A. rap scene, basically. Yeah. You want to take that, Andre? Yeah. Well, I mean, Dirt, you know, knew evidence from before. I knew Rocka from just the hood and everything, but, you know, I, everybody just knows each other in L.A. pretty much. It's, it's yeah. a big city, but it's very small, so, you know. Yeah, okay. you know, you know, you know all the other rappers. I mean, there's not too many of them in LA. Okay, so what, what can we expect from you for for your album, the upcoming EP? My upcoming EP, I don't know. How do we describe that? Dirt. It's pretty, you know, like usual, gangster, dirty, very uh, <laughs> uh, fun, and uh, it's gonna be different. It's gonna be different from my first album, but yet somewhat the same. You got some more up tempo joints, yeah. some faster ones. You got, I, I love some of the new stuff. It, it's probably gonna be called King of Hollywood. He's got the song King of Hollywood. Yeah. That's okay. So we got the title right there. It's yeah. gonna be called the King of Hollywood. And mine's gonna be called Nasty as I Wanna Be. That's the Alchemist song I did. That's uh, kind of like an homage to Two Live Crew. Oh, I also just did a song with Two Live Crew. That's another one. Oh, so you got Two Live Crew yeah. and Two Short. Yeah, it's too oh, crazy. Yeah. It's, it's getting really nasty. <laughs> Dirt nasty, really like dirt. for real, for real. It's crazy because they're all they're all reaching out. I mean, I didn't think anyone would take it like really like my stuff, but they really think it's funny and they're like, we want to work with this dude. You know, like Warren G called me about the blue. He saw me on Paris Hilton's TV show and was like, I gotta work with that dude. So I just did a song with him. It's crazy. I, I didn't think any of this would happen. <laughs> okay, so it's it. happening. Y'all doing it here? Y'all on San Ho tonight? Voodoo Lounge tonight. Yes, come down, nasty show. Go over to Voodoo Lounge, get in there, have a good time. Come on down, y'all. It's a party. Even if you don't like our music, come look at all the hot girls. You know what I mean? We're gonna have some fun. Okay, okay. So we're getting to uh, 1980 right here. Yes, this is my okay. anthem. So this, this is the anthem right here. If you ain't seen the video, YouTube it. Yes. You need to check it out. It is crazy. Uh, loving the Alf doll. Yeah, man. Had the video. Had the Alf doll is cracking. Uh, you want to give a little <laughs> insight on the video, man? Yeah, my boy Nick Goosen, who directed Grandma's Boy. He's our friend, and he directed a lot of videos for me and Beardo and Andre Legacy and Mickey Avalon. And he's our go-to guy, man. He really just paints the picture for our funny lyrics. And uh, we did this video, 1980, for under $1,000, man. It's got over 2 million. got like 3 million hits or something crazy. And we just, it's got, right. I think it just got a lot of heart, and it's funny, and it's like, you know, you know what's funny is in the beginning I do that like freestyle spoof where I'm like metaphysical wizard yeah. third chapter now, dimensions. Now, now is that a Jedi mind's diss? Everyone always says that. I don't even know who that is. I don't know who he is. I mean, I've heard of him, but I, yeah. I'm not. Who are those guys? I don't know who they are. No, I don't, I'm not making fun of anyone. I'm just kind of making fun of that style in general that I think is very wordy because I'd like my it stuff is. to be like too short, like in the pocket. You if know you know notice, he had a backpack on. Huh? Yeah, he did. You backpack it in. Yeah, got the markers ready to go. <laughs> but I'm not dissing anyone. I was just kind of making fun of that wordy rap to me. That I just don't like. We love you, back. Pack rappers, you guys keep it real. We love you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get into it. 1980, dirt nasty. Oh yeah. 90.5 FM, Kesha, San Jose.